गाइस वेलकम टू फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइस टुडे आई क्रिएट वन मोर टाइम वाटर स्प्लैश एनिमेशन विद यूजिंग रियल फ्लो प्लगइन सो गाइस फर्स्टली आई क्रिएट ऑब्जेक्ट रियल फ्लो इफेक्ट सो यूज स्पेयर एंड आई इंक्रीज स्पेयर रेडियस रेडियस गाइस दिस टाइम आई टेक 150 सेंटीमीटर लाइक दिस एंड नाउ गाइस आई यूज रियल फ्लो सो गो टू रियल फ्लो प्लगइन एंड टेक स्क्रीन यस and again go to real flow and emitter and guys this time i take fill yes and guys see that's my emitter and emitter type use fill and that's my body so connect with sphere so select this sphere drag and drop on body yeah and hide this sphere hide and hide on render see guys that's my sphere right okay so guys all is good now i go to flood and resolution you can create i like 10 yes and type use liquid this one same pbd yes and guys play okay so guys now i apply mesh tool so use mesh real flow and use mesh tool yes go to back yeah right okay so guys change some setting on mesh so select on mesh tool and thickness guys i change only thickness thickness i take like 0.8 yes right okay so guys that's it it's my simple cube actually spare and now i take cube and cube size i take smaller like 25 and all 25 cm yes and go on here like this guys create smoothness from edges so fill it check and fill it radius i take 1 cm yes that's it guys okay so guys now i apply vibrator tag on here this one cube so select this cube and right click and use real flow tag actually use firstly vibrator this one yeah and enable position check an amplitude i take like guys randomly like 800 and 500 and 800 yes and frequency decrease i take like 0.5 yes and go to back and play see guys right i change position so firstly go on here like this Okay so guys also rotation and enable rotation all take 360 360 and 360 and frequency i take 0.2 is better yes and play right see guys that's my cube okay so guys now i increase frame frame i take like 1000 i take 1000 frame yes and select this cube and all position take 0 0 yeah right okay so guys now apply rigid body actually tag real flow tag go on here and use collider yes and play okay so guys stop now i decrease tag amplitude like 500 and 300 and 500 yes and play guys you can change also seed like this and play see guys that's my splash animation see that's really good yeah nice see guys that's my animation right okay so guys now i apply material so i go to on create and load material guys I already create material so apply gold material on mesh and silver material on cube 
yeah and go to back and play guys it's take little bit time because it's heavy mesh yes okay so guys now guys gravity i change so go to on mode and project and i go to dynamic and gravity i take zero centimeter yes and again play right i really like this animation guys okay so guys now i stop this animation it's really really good see right it's really splashy animation yeah great okay so guys now i apply light so use sky and apply sdri light yes and apply compositing tag this one yes and scene by camera uncheck great okay so guys animation is good now i create camera movement animation so use camera and camera check and guys my first camera angle like this this one yes and press this animation key check and guys go to 200 frames 200 and camera angle like this go on here and check guys go to 500 frames 500 and change camera angle on top like this and check and guys go to 800 frames 800 and again camera angle change on back side like this and check and guys go to 1000 frame 1000 and change camera like this and check right okay so guys go to back and play yes guys see that's my camera path right okay so guys it's all is good see okay so guys now i stop this animation i go to render setting and guys same ambient occlusion and global illumination but guys global illumination indirectly catch a and record density i take low and anti-analysis take past and guys take all frame yes and that's my save and guys i take jpeg sequences i have already create renders and go to desktop create new folder like anyone splash okay so guys file name yes and all is good and render okay so guys that's it and guys i change some color correction so go down filter and enable filter check and saturation i take like 20 and contrast i take 2 and brightness take 2 after render go on here save as and type i take animation and format same JPEG sequences and most important part use filter check and press OK. See guys, right? Okay, so guys, that's it. It's my simple water splash animation is finished. So if you like my video, please share and subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you.